Hello, 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 and welcome to another Rang Rouge unit of the Reek. And today we are taking a look at the MTLB Vasilik artillery piece for the USSR. So the Vasilik, or Cornflower, as the translation tells me, is an 82mm gun mortar developed in the Soviet Union during the late 60s and ended up into service in 1970. Now, what makes it stand apart from other mortars is that first, it doesn't exactly look like a mortar, it looks more like a field harrocher, but don't be alarmed, it is an actual mortar. And number two is that it can shoot extremely fast. Instead of loading the rounds run by run from the muzzle, you can load the ammunition in four round stripper clips, either from the breech or from the muzzle of the gun, giving it a fire rate of 120 rounds per minute, which is a lot of DACA for an artillery piece per se. Now, the Soviets have used this during the war in Afghanistan, and even some are being used today in the Syrian Civil War. And, of course, in-game, they literally just mounted this on top of an MTLB. They didn't do the American thing of cutting a hole in the middle of an M113 and putting a mortar in there. Oh no, they, they took the gun carriage and everything and slapped it on top of an APC and called it a day. In game, the MTLB Vasilik is a 45 point mortar with two weapons available to it. So let's just completely skip the first weapon because the chances of you ever using this is slim to none. So let's take a look at the 2B9 Vasilik, the mortar piece in question of 100 rounds available to it. With a range round of 5km, a dispersion of 2.7km, 3HE, and a rate of fire of 20 rounds a minute. Overall, rather standard mortar cells, except for the rate of fire, which plays much more interest when you actually get in game and if we pop down to his miscellaneous set it's got one front alarm on that side run it back and none up top 10 hp small size bad optics speed is 60 kilometers off road 110 on the road 500 kilometer autonomy it is amphibious is restricted 1982 and type restricted to motorized armored mechanized and support decks in battle the mtlb vasilik is well it's very different from its other mortar buddies and that is because instead of just going bang 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 it goes bang 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 it finishes br its barrage very quickly only a few seconds to let off all of the shots and honestly that is a pretty damn good thing for two reasons first up you get it all out quicker meaning you can do more damage and secondly it gives the enemy less reaction time because of a standard mortar the enemy may get hit by the first few rounds, but they may be able to reverse or get out of there before the last shot from the branch actually hit. And that's what made the Fast League really bloody fun, because it's, it's a shotgun spread of high explosive coming at you. I would say the downside is that it's not as effective for precision smoking, because it lets off all of it at once. You can't do one smoke round here and one smoke round here. And yeah, you kind of just have to shoot it all off and then shoot off it all again. Also, it does use up quite a bit of ammunition because of how fast the gun actually fires. But apart from yeah, it's a pretty standard mortar. You use it for mortar stuff, for killing infantry and lightly armored targets. But instead of just doing it slowly but surely, the vast leak just it gets you all out. It is a very fast of the gun. And I'm going to leave it off. Yeah, this has been another Rangaroo unit of the week. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as usual, please just take it easy.